Yo. Okay. Hey. Well, it's been a while since I've been on, mainly because um, I've been busy, obviously, and um, partly because there's been a new batch of games released on sale, and I wanted to take a look. So I got a list together, and there was like 300 games on the list. And you know, when you think about it, if you take a minute to just look at the store, read a YouTube review, all that sort of stuff, you know, you're already like five hours going through that list actually it's been like it's felt like a day do you know what i mean it's just been constant like i've been sat in the office just spreadsheet going through a list of games fucking how tedious is that but i managed to get that list down to 40 games so it's not a complete waste of time because actually the other 260 games on the list are games that i'm not i don't want so that means i don't so next time i import a list like on the list was 700 games 400 just got filtered out straight away of because of the previous work I've done. So the next time I import a list, if those 260 games are on there, they get filtered out as games I'm not really interested in. And mm, You have to be organised when you got a video games addiction. So I bought, yeah, about 40 titles, 37, I think. Um, where are we at? I already had Truck Driver. Tourist bus was the recent one I bought, and that. So, from there, so I got Drago Dino. I don't know platformer. That's a pinball game. I do like my pinball. That's like a puzzle platformer. Uh, Quantic Pinball is a pinball game. Um, <laughs> another flipping pinball game. Safari Pinball. I'm not sure what that Backfire Wall is exactly. I can't remember. First person, tragic comic adventure. Yeah, it actually, it, oh, it's like where you enter a phone and stuff. Actually sounds pretty cool. Um, this sounds cool, this game, Black Skylands. It sounds really cool. It's um, like a sort of mix of like RPG and like twin stick top-down shooter and like farm builder. It's just everything. This sounds pretty cool, Boris, the, uh, the rocket. You know, you're like working in a missile bunker and you've got to, do all sorts of tedious things and you know what i mean another pinball game bloody hell uh, oh this looks really good this is those old wooden 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 railway tracks and you sort of like lay it all out and create like train tracks around the place and stuff i can't wait to have a go on that uh i've got train sim so you know another sim thing another pinball game i didn't realize i got so many actually uh this is i think this is one of those like low polygon sort of scary games or maybe not the low polygon but certainly scary game um again this this was reviewed really well um i don't know can't remember i did get good reviews Catan, which i play on pc and on mobile phone but i just thought oh, i might as well get the console edition while it's on sale commander 85 1980s sort of like nostalgia with hacking and freaking probably i don't think people talk about freaking anymore where you've got free phone calls uh dark u or dark two and a half d puzzle platform a bug academy which is a bit of a like puzzle sort of game um dolings yeah that's like space invaders if you like but with like colorful space invaders uh escape for escape game fort boyard there's a few fort boyard games and this is like the lesser of the three evils so i thought i'd have a look at that flying soldiers a bit like lemmings but like more coding the actions um, this is like a bit like Total Battle Simulator. It's a battle simulator game, basically. Looks a bit of fun. Hell, why not? Um, Cola, not really sure. Um, I think it's like a survival game or something like that. Um, oh, okay. It's that, that Soviet incident, Dialov Pass, where um, like seven or nine very experienced hikers died and and they found that like they'd cut the way out of the tent and some of them had eyes missing some of them were in the river 
people have suspected all sorts of supernatural stuff. It was only quite recently that they re reopened the case in about 2019. So this is like in the 1950s it all happened. And then in 2019 they reopened it and they've concluded it was an avalanche. Although I bet the nut job will dispute that. Martha is dead, supposed to be pretty good. That's a low, Murder House is a low polygon sort of horror, which are some of the worst horrors for being scary. Um, this again is a low polygon ho horror as well, so it should be pretty good. Um, I think the same developer, um, three low polygon sort of ho horrors that I got. This is, I don't know how to pronounce it, Oniros, a 2021 title. Um, I can't remember much about it, but um, can you re experience this surreal adventure film? I don't, I just don't, I think it's a sort of, you know, single playthrough. This looks pretty cool. It's like, it's a, basically, it's a platform shooter, but it's like a 360 platform. So, I don't know, should be cool. Um, Q Yo Blaster. If you that's how you say it. Uh, horizontal shoot em up. There is another horizontal shoot em up that I got that was pretty cool. But I mean, I, I've got enough shmups, but um, I just thought, yeah, this this sounds like pretty good, pretty well rated as well. Uh, River Bond, I mean, it seemed okay, and also it's got like co op as well, so I thought I might as well have a go. I'll always like. If in doubt, give it to the multiplayer games, really. Um, Robot Squad Simulator. This is looks fairly crap, actually, but, you know, you, you, it's a sim game where you're playing as, like, little, you know, like the Bond Diffusion robots or something like that. Um, Rover Mechanic Simulator. Again, doesn't look great, but you're basically fixing, like, the Mars rovers and stuff like that. So it should, should be an interesting, like learning experience anyway space station sprint is like a fast paced um like shooter it's like a cross between like hotline miami and i don't know like a, th a 3d game if you like it is yeah it's pretty cool um oh where am i at no nope. um last six uh stay out of the house um Again, low polygon uh, horror game, so it should be pretty cool. Should be pretty scary. I've got this game on PC, but because it was on sale, I was just like, you know what, I'll get it on Xbox. I haven't played it on PC yet, and I might just be in the mood for it while I'm on the Xbox, as opposed to sitting upstairs. So I, I just thought I'd grab it. Um, Sundered. Which I presume is that how you say it. I don't usually go for Metroidvania titles, but this this has come so highly rated. I was like, you know what? Might as well have a look. Sounds pretty cool. Um, Transcripted, which is basically like a mishmash of like twin stick shooter, bullet hell style game, and then like a, a gem matching thing. You know, when you've got to match three gems, a bit like Zuma. I love Zuma. I think it's a great game. Zero Strain, fast pace shooter, top down arenas. Um, again, bullet hell type thing. So, should be cool. Up my street. And then Ziggurat 2. I think you pronounce it Ziggurat. Um, which the first one was well acclaimed. And the second one was that it's just like a sort of vibrant dungeon sort of crawler. Which, you know, this, these are like. Ten a penny, to be honest, but so it's nothing that special. But I just thought, well, I might as well have a good look at it. Now the problem is, I've got all this crap queuing up, as well as updates. It's been downloading for now, and it's barely downloaded anything. So um, that should take some time. Um, in which case, I'm going to have a bash of a game. I'm not sure what to play though, because I am. Do my yawns already, and it's 10:44 p.m. I just need a bash of something. So, um, hmm. 
Let's go on bus simulator then. Like what I call it bus simulator because that's what it's called. <laughs> it's like a fucking hell. Um, but on PC, I, I was trying to figure out, well, what is this equivalent to on PC? It's equivalent to bus simulator 18. So there is no like bus simulator category on Twitch or YouTube. It's just bus simulator bus simulator 18 now i haven't been on this for quite some time actually so be interesting it won't be interesting it's but it's bus simulator but it'll be a learning curve again a small learning curve oh have they got oh i know this now you see articulated buses the electrics I, I this is how sad it got for me i actually looked at a youtube video of the, of the longest buses in the world and that's how i know that some of them are double articulated there you go i'm tired because i did the gym quite heavily yesterday and i just yeah, when i really go for it and and it's not much point in going to the gym unless you're pushing yourself beyond your comfort zone. I have a terrible night's sleep and um, I just ache all the time. I feel constantly hungry for two days. I called it Stagecoach, which is my local com um, bus company. Well, mm. in North East Derbyshire. I should have had a strong coffee. Mm. I've got a few games now where um, I can sort of visit my hometown in the game, which is pretty cool, actually. Um, one of them being Flight Simulator. That, that should be pretty cool to be able to, to to, well, I've done it, and it's on it's on the channel. But. Um, oh, I hope this doesn't go crazy with because of the downloading. These are my buses. Multiplayer. Well, I must have done it at some point, but cool. Okay, so I think I did a mega route. You know, I'm going to do that. I'm going to have to go on that mega route. I've got no drive button there, so um, I'm going to do it during the day. God, crikey. How to open doors and do that. Oh my god, how much time did I spend on this game then to be able to remember that? Um, day regular one. Give 13 
80 change. Thank you. There is a bus simulator 21 out now. So I don't know how much better that is as that is his game. Even though Tourist Bus Simulator is a more recent title, this seems to have better handling, you know. I hate to say it. what was being said then so we said oh there's oh thank god i managed to catch the bus wait is this even the, the right bus i don't know if it's the right bus or not Can't really avoid those potholes. Missed the stop. Let's try and get this one right because I don't know what's happened there. I don't know why I've missed a stop. How did I not see a stop? God dang, no it. Let me just get a glass of water because my mouth is going dry. And I think that's also why I'm tired is because I'm actually quite oh, thirsty. I seem to be drinking. I'm convinced I've got uric acid that needs flushing out I think isn't that what happens when you when you like do an aerobic exercise you end up with like uric acid and you need water to get rid of it I think anyway right let's get going do it all over again Day regular um, oh for the L. Thank you. 
Town, this. Look at all the garbage along the roadside. Why can't people manage their own trash? Time I seem to really hit that part on. Avoided it that time. Next stop, old sawmill. Which I missed last time. Maybe it's just out in the road, maybe it's not like the obvious. Yeah. Did that chicken just cross the road? Oh, bloody potholes everywhere. after the corner, isn't it? Oh, 
Oh, I think I know what that sound is. Don't people press like the bell when they want to pull over at a stop? Just one of my drivers here. Yeah, with some strange dialogue just to fill the silence. I don't think there's anybody else that sort of missed the bus really. Looks like there's traffic building up ahead but I've got another stop to get to so I can't sort of move a different way. I like the German names of places. down there isn't that seed bulb and stuff oh. Feels like we party the whole night through with the old song. I am so tired. Let me out. Mm. I feel like I've left somebody there. I would call that a Lido. It's probably not a British name, is it? Thank you. 
episodes, Winter of Passion is still going strong. These roads get worse every day. Seems like even if I slow down and I hit a pothole, it still counts as hitting a pothole. So fair, like fair enough. Oh, there's my chump. You really need to see the view down at the harbor. actually got a bus pass on them. Of course. Mm -hmm. ah. yeah. there you go. And what about you? I thought I had one. 120 euros fine there. It's an expensive fine, isn't it? Hey, long time no see. How was your vacation in Sunny Springs? Oh, it was awesome. Sightseeing and shopping all day long. <laughs> Sounds lovely. I think I'll book a vacation there for next year. Oh, for God's sake. I can't believe that's a part of Looks all right to me. This was a route I made myself, actually. I, I designed it. There's always traffic coming in here. This should be double your lane, really. One one lane goes straight on. One lane turns off to the left. Because it's people turning off to the left that's holding you put it back. I need to combine bus simulator with like some sort of city management game. Well, I don't know why you couldn't do that really. Design your own city and then run the bus routes around that city. I'm sure we're not far away from something like that. I finally got my husband to see Winter of Passion. Now he's an even bigger fan than me. I bet you there's no potholes around the nice commercial district. Oh, there might be actually. middle-aged hedonists, aren't they, on this bus? Not the guy who had to work. Oh, 
come on. I end up being the one who ends up legging it for ages though, trying to find which passenger has left what. What is it? I can't see anything. What? Oh, here you go. So now... Which passenger left what? Sure. Oh, I, I can't get to it. Watch out. Which passenger? Is it this guy? Who was it? Anybody? Anybody want this thing? I don't mind who takes it. I'm not going to squabble. But he's fit, isn't he, this bus driver? For somebody who sits on their ass all bloody day. Well, opportunity gone. That woman sat there blocking it. She could have, she could have said something. Do you know what I mean? She could have said, "Oh, you've left your bag." Oh, it's nice that they flash you as the driving by. walking out into the middle of the bus stop when I'm arriving, you know what I mean? Bye. No idea whose thing that was then in the end, to be honest, so. Missed it. Yo, <laughs> fugitive. <laughs> hey, Joe, you all right? Do you know this? Uh, do you know this title? It's the most hardcore game on Xbox. People think it's just sitting around driving buses. <laughs> but I assure you, there's so much more to it. He's gone. And I've just missed a nice little pothole, thank God. Let's 
I don't know why they're pressing the buzzer. I stop at every stop as it is. I'm going to electrify those buzzers. So, what I don't know about this single, regular, what I'm not 100% sure of is like, if I do this perfectly, does that mean One ticket, please. every driver, student, don't look like a student to me, mate, but then again, I'm not allowed to question, it's beyond my pay pay grade to be doing that. Thank you. Um if I get this perfect all these stops, I I see oh that's kind. Um then um I think my driver gets the stops perfect as well. You know what I mean? Like I set the I don't know how to explain it. Like I, I have a driver to run these bus stops. And if I do a run and I get like 200 quid, 200 euros or whatever. They got my best side. Speed violation, motherfucker. Oh yeah, I've taken the limiter off for some reason, damn it. Right. Anyway, as I say, if, let me just do this. If I run it and I get three hundred dollars, then my driver will pretty much get three hundred dollars a session week ticket student two. But if I get like less, then my driver will get less and or you know what I mean, I think it bases their income off like what I set as precedent type thing. I think I don't know. I might have just dream that. I hate the commercial breaks in yes. fashion. I've had a dream about right the simulator. <laughs> no. I don't think I have. I don't I don't remember having a dream about the simulator. and close to this going from. That's what buses do, don't they? Right up close. Come on. Shift it. Right crap horn that is. Oh. Get a move on. Some of us have a bus business to run. Don't worry about pedestrians, just go floor it. Oh, I wasn't in gear. Come on, let me go, let me go. Oh, where's the stop? Oh no, this is me. Come on, you need 
relatively aggressive driving in the city. I've not killed anybody this route, that's always a positive as well. No pedestrians. I've not not had any passengers get off and then run them over afterwards. I could say I'm improving. I've gained a conscience. Oh for God's sake. I think about potholes, speed bumps, all sorts of stuff. At least I've got the speed limit on, so I can't get it speeding by. This is actually quite a long route. Now, I will buy the DLC for this. Timing. It's the traffic, that's what's made me late. Three student tickets. Does he look like a student? I uh, might be a mature student, but. Um, Yesterday was. I spent the afternoon with and then partied all night with soccer. Thank you. I had to work. Thank you. Welcome. Um, regular week. Thanks. Welcome. Right. This is a good leg of the journey actually down here. Good job you don't I get like I had one. 120 euro fine. That's not telling that lady about a handbag as well. She probably paid for the money out of the other lady's handbag. You know what I mean? Had her fingers in the purse. Right. Was that try, try my best to hold potholes. the way I've planned this route then. If, if I've got one last stop down here. Oh, come on. Does nobody use indicators anymore? Oh. drugs you took at the sawmill have worn off yet mate that's why you've seen UFOs this weird this whole town they all go out to the sawmill get absolutely smashed and then talk about it the next day pretty nice actually I just wonder how big the sawmill is We used to go to a place called the Lead Mill in Sheffield. It's famous. Oh, for God's sake, fucking pothole. I'll pay, I'll, you know, as a local business owner, I'll pay. Well, I probably do pay business rates, don't I? Business taxes that should, should have the local authority fill those in, but I'll pay privately. 
wrecking these buses. I think I've hit about six potholes. There we go, there's that's seven, make that seven fucking things. I don't know, that's swerving into oncoming traffic. How the hell am I supposed to avoid them? on the passengers. I'll stop. Get the hell off my bus. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the last stop, Fisher's Ground. Please leave the bus. Thank you for riding with Stagecoach. Thanks for being so punctual. Thank you for thanking me. Can you drop garbage, motherfuckers? You filthy bastards. I want to pick that up and I'm going to throw it at the back of his head. Where is it? the only responsible way to deal with garbage. Where the hell is it? Seriously? I can't see any garbage. No. There's nothing. Don't tell me it was that old lady. Oh, it was. Unbelievable. So she didn't she didn't hand in that bloody handbag. Oh. <laughs> I'm going to watch out for her. Future trips. Right, let's get back to the garage. Drop this bus off. I don't know what they're waiting for. There's no lights there. Um, drop this bus off and then um, see what the damage is. Eight potholes. Should be alright. I think this is one of the better routes I've done, apart from all those potholes. But I've got a couple of fines in. Oh, that's why she left a cup, because I fined her 120 euros. Fair dues. Well, I'm not going to declare that fine, I'm just going to stick it into my back pocket. It's my own business anyway, actually, so... But at least Mr. Taxman doesn't get it. That's the main thing. He's a cheeky one, isn't he? He's just run those lights. depots all around this place. I can't remember buying depots. So I don't know where they've come from actually, if they're just awarded to me or, or what. Nice little place this actually, I like it here. It's clean. Mm. 
people are clean. <laughs> Apart from a couple of the old people, they smell a bit funny, especially when it's when it's raining. But Apart from that, most of them are clean. Wait, where am I going left here? No? Oh my god. I don't understand who's got right away. This is that awkward one where it's like in between those two posts along the crossing. Okay, am I stuck? Now, oh. what's that button do? It's a retarded. Thing. Why is that ticket machine still on then? This thing down here. Well, I'll give up. Sounds positive, all of that. Four out of five stars. 27,000 bloody euros for one bus trip. So that means I think that route, now I've done that nicely, I think it's got a... Um, how much did I make previous? 54 and then 71 this week. So... I think I can assign a driver to that. Excellent work. I knew you could pull it off. I'm happy to hand you the keys to the agricultural and industrial areas. <laughs> Metaphorically speaking, of course, we haven't done real keys in a very long time, no matter. We're really looking forward to your plans to incorporate these two traffic-dense areas into your network. If you manage to pull this off, the city is willing to reopen up the southern areas and Steineck for public transport. Some friends of mine are planning to marry at the chapel. I'll cut her off. Oh. Right, mission objectives. I just remembered that it was like left click. But I... I can't. I don't know how I've remembered that. Current objectives. 
assign at least one more driver and raise CNG and select CNG buses only. Try the route with the CNG bus and something, something, something. Well, I managed to stay awake. So I'm pleased about that. I don't know what I need to do to save it, unless it just saves it automatically. I managed to get a good chunk of those games downloaded as well. I've got 28 to go. So I must have installed. Um, take 11 off that. 28 minus 11, 27, 17. Oh, I must have installed 17 games. I've got 17 to go and then 11 updates. So yeah, it's been it's been a little bit productive. I'm going to have to leave the Xbox on all night, I think, and just get those killed off. Um, yeah, a little bit of bus simulator anyway. One room. I might I might check out. I don't know which, which of these games I've now played actually. Um, no, I mean I don't know which is installed and what I can play, but I might check one of them out actually. I don't know. See, see, what time is it? Oh, it's half eleven. No, fuck that. I'm gonna have a bath. Right, I will go, and then I will be. I'll come back on at a later stage. Um, tomorrow is what I mean by that. And I don't know. Probably do some some one of those new games we've got or something like that. I don't know, or something. Anyway, sorry, I'm just tired. Take it easy and catch you next time. Adios.